We're back home now and I wanted to showcase some of the items that I got during our Christmas celebration because this year we celebrated Christmas as a family on Thanksgiving week because Seth and Kaylee will be with Kaylee's family for the Christmas holiday. So we did some small gifts for Tiny and myself because we'll spend Christmas with my parents. And so I'll showcase a few things that I got from them as well as some gifts that I got from Seth. And you're gonna question what year it is. You're gonna think, is this really 2021 because of the gifts that Jesse got? But yes, we are still in the year 2021. But here's what we got. Um, as we know, as of recently, I've been sharing that I'm a collector of old school WCW toys, specifically Hollywood Hulk Hogan. And I got this, uh, I think this came out in 1998, I believe, and the Hollywood Hulk Hogan toy. And then we got some WCW NWO stickers. This is one of three. I just recently put two other stickers on my computer. I got some Burger King Kids Club action figures, which are from, shoot, early 90s, I think. Let's see, 1990. 1990, these suckers are 21 years old. Wait, 21, is that right? Oh my goodness, 31. 31 years old, 31 years old. And then I got uh, the Spirit of Christmas album of Ray Charles, Heart in Motion from Amy Grant. They're both on cassette tape. Again, what year are we in? Well, it's still 2021. Seth got me this, and you're probably wondering what this is. This is called the Grim Ripper. It's from a Buttheads toy line. And listen to this. Yeah, and more. Yeah. That, and ladies and gentlemen, I am 34 years old still. Then um, got this World Trade Center book from my brother. This was when the, the terrorist attacks happened on 9-11, I became transfixed with the World Trade Center towers and everything that happened that day. And this is a book that basically covers those events as well as just showcasing the beauty of those towers. So this is a gem of a gift for sure. So there's that. And then today, when Tiny and I were in Fort Dodge for Black Friday stuff, I found this. I'm a massive, massive NSYNC fan. And this was a must buy. This is a Pop Funko 2021 Walmart exclusive with all five members of the band in some of their highlighted uniforms that they wore while they were performing on stage with a uh, plastic vinyl record behind. It doesn't actually play, but it's just for, you know, showcasing purposes. And then it has the album cover from their very first album there as well. And it's in plexiglass, so you can hang it on the wall and showcase it. But yeah, there you go, yes. Oh, and this as well. This was a brochure from the summer of 1973 for the Friar Tuck Inn. And Seth gave this to me. This is the 500 room Rue hotel and resort that uh, Seth, Tiny, and I went in. Speaking of Tiny. And her new Christmas jammies. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And so that's this, has the rates, uh, the weekend rates, let's see. The deluxe room, first or second floors, twin beds or double beds, 65 a weekend, 97.50 for a holiday weekend, 26 bucks for any day during the midweek. Soup and entrees, desserts, all sorts of cool stuff. So that's a really cool piece of history from the Urbex adventure we had inside the Friar Tuck Inn. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. We are leaving Ma and Pa's tomorrow to head back to normal life for the next few weeks before we head back for Christmas. It's a little get, getting a little dark here, but I wanted to, to set the tone to finish up. But yeah, that's been the It's All Me Thanksgiving week, thanks, Thanksgiving celebration. Thanks for joining us here again on It's All Me. It's always great to be home amongst the Christmas lights, amongst the family and amongst the love and the good food because I've been off keto this whole time, so I've been gorging on all the non-keto items. But as always, it's all me and no foot. Thank you for joining us, and we will see you on the next one.